Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome back in our lesson today. And in this video, we are going to talk about a uh, new topic. Yeah, actually, it uh, it is still about uh, electric yeah electric things. Yeah, but now uh, we are going to learn about the electric electric field. Yeah. Okay, so. I'm sorry if this slide is in Bahasa Indonesia, but I will translate it for you. Yeah, so this is the electric uh, field, yeah, or medan listrik, yeah, in Bahasa Indonesia. Okay, so what is electric field, yeah? Okay, so basically, yeah, as we know that there are two kinds of electric charge, yeah. Uh, the first one is uh, positive, yeah. Uh, and the positive charge yeah uh, can be found in the proton yeah proton part yeah of the of an atom yeah and then the second one is the negative yeah which is the uh, electron yeah okay and um, let's say we have one proton yeah Let's say this is the proton, yeah. and then in the uh, surrounding area, yeah, the area close to to the um, to the to this charge, yeah, we can find there is a field, yeah, that is affected, yeah, to the electric uh, current, yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, there is an area, yeah, surround uh, close to this uh, charge, yeah, that is that still can be uh, felt, yeah. Uh, I'm sorry, no, about the felt. Yeah. In uh, okay, so so basically, yeah, in in the area of this charge, yeah, you will find that there is still an area that has um, field, yeah, the the field that uh, that you can feel the electric uh, charge, yeah. So let's say this is the proton, and then uh, there is an area, yeah, that uh, there is still uh, electric field, yeah, around the the uh, around the proton, yeah, and also this happens to the uh, electron, yeah, which is the area of this the surrounding area, yeah, of the uh, of this charge, yeah, has something called uh, field, yeah, field of Exposure yeah, of electric exposure, yeah. Okay, and yeah, okay. So in this picture, yeah, uh, we have Q, the big Q, and the small Q, and the big key, uh, the 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 big uh, the big Q, yeah, is the um, main. It's called with the main charge, yeah, yeah, and the charge that uh, produce electric field, yeah, and then this is the uh, object, yeah, yeah, or we can say, mm, wait a minute, okay, so or the tested. yeah, tested charge, yeah, meanwhile this is the uh, main charge yeah or or source charge yeah but I think um, the better one is main charge yeah I think I, I don't I don't think with this one yeah okay so we are going to use main charge yeah and I suppose for this one yeah and for this one this is the tested charge, yeah, and depend on this uh, explanation, yeah. Uh, so there is a uh, there is a distance, yeah, distance between the main charge and the tested charge, yeah. Let's say this is the we call it with the R one, and then this is the R two, yeah, and Logically, yeah, we can say that, yeah, 
the electric charge, uh, the electric field, yeah, of the first case, yeah. So, so, so this is the first case, yeah. So this is case. Uh, this is the case one, and then this is second case, yeah. Ah, we can say that the electric field, yeah, of one, yeah. Uh, Q, yeah. the electric field that a uh, field yeah by the Q one yeah it will be bigger than uh, the electric field uh, that exposed yeah for the um, the second case yeah and yeah the because um, the distance yeah of the R one is close yeah compared is closer compared to the second area so we can say that um, this tested charge uh, will feel different f amount of electric uh, field yeah which is the second case yeah uh, which is the, the first case yeah will be higher yeah compared to the second case yeah okay now next yeah and then okay so I think I will move this slide yeah okay now this is uh, the um, formula yeah the formula to uh, calculate the, the electric uh, the electric field yeah this is the formula so the formula is the, the basic formula yeah is this yeah so this is the uh, electric field yeah And then this is the tested charge, yeah. Or sometimes it it also called with tested um, object. And then this one is um, a force, yeah. Force produced by uh, the source charge here. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. Okay, so let's say yeah, this, we have two uh, protons here. The first proton has uh, Q, yeah, elect uh, Q charge, yeah, and then the second one has small Q charge, yeah. So um if we uh, take a look on the um uh, column uh column low yeah to find the force yeah to find the force of uh to find the force produced by a certain electric charge yeah so the formula will be like this k yeah k1 times q2 divided by r2 yeah in this case yeah the q1 yeah uh, is the big q and then the q2 is the small q yeah so this one is the main charge yeah who produce the electric uh, electrical field electric field yeah meanwhile yeah, this one is um, the tested the tested charge. Yeah. Okay. Now, based on this one, yeah. So we are going to put yeah this value into this uh, formula. So this is F. Yeah. Okay. And then the second one is okay divided by this. R square, yeah. Then Q one will be big Q, yeah. And then Q two will be small Q, yeah. So this is for the uh, for the force, yeah. Meanwhile, if we want to find the electric field, then we have to divide, yeah, the force, yeah, with 
uh, the tested charge yeah. so um, our formula yeah will be uh, F yeah equals to uh, oh no I put E yeah E yeah E will be F yeah so F this one yeah so I will put this one into this one yeah okay R square yeah PQ and small Q yeah divided by the R2 yeah uh, divided by uh, E F yeah this is E this is F yeah and divided by Q yeah and we can uh, eliminate this so we, we, we got uh, K yeah Q R square yeah. so this is the uh, formula yeah, to calculate the electrical field uh, to calculate elect electric field yeah uh, in a certain area yeah uh, from the main source yeah where the E yeah is the electrical charge yeah so this is electrical uh, electrical electric field yeah I mean yeah and the unit is uh, newton per column yeah and then the q pq yeah sometimes you can also find only q yeah but this is the pq yeah pq is the source or the main uh, charge yeah the unit is column then the, the small q yeah small q is the uh, tested charge yeah also column for the unit and then r yeah is the distance between main uh main charge to the tested charge yeah and then the f yeah is the force yeah force of the main charge yeah okay now for the okay so in the end of this video we are going to apply yeah, our concept yeah, but before we start doing uh, calculation uh, I want to give you some another concept yeah about the um, electric force line yeah okay okay so this uh, this concept yeah will tell us about how um, charge yeah how charge will uh, produce force yeah uh, it uh, for some charge yeah for one charge yeah it will be it will expel yeah and then for another charge it will attract yeah so if we take a look on this one yeah uh, this is the uh, direction yeah direction of, of uh, force yeah yeah or direction of force line yeah for positive charge yeah and you can see yeah if we have a uh, proton here then the direction of force yeah will um, will out yeah the direction will uh, will lift yeah the direction will lift uh, the charge yeah okay meanwhile this is for the direction of uh, yeah, force line yeah for negative here yeah. and if you can see yeah this is the electron so the the line yeah the line the first line yeah will uh, go yeah into the charge yeah so you can see the difference yeah between these two one this is the uh, the, the proton the line will uh, leave yeah I mean while uh, for the negative charge yeah the line will uh, will move yeah 
into the direction of uh, will move into the uh, electrons yeah okay now if we if i if you if we are asked to uh, throw yeah uh, to throw the electric uh, to throw the line force yeah so it will be like this yeah so if we have okay so this is throw yeah throwing the force line yeah so if we have a uh, proton here and also we have electron here then um, the proton yeah the first line of proton yeah will leave its uh, charge yeah so this is the proton and this is the first line yeah and meanwhile the negative charge yeah will uh, will attract yeah will attract um will attract the uh, what to say will 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 attract into yeah the the, the electron yeah so uh, the throwing will be like this yeah the line will leave the proton and will go into the uh, negative charge yeah and this happens yeah okay and then if what if we have two different uh, charge yeah let's say this, this one is positive and this one is also positive then uh, there will no any line that go into the charge yeah you can see yeah okay the line yeah will will has uh, will leave yeah will leave the, the protons yeah for this one yeah the line will uh, move away yeah, from the proton meanwhile yeah for the other proton yeah the phenomenon is also the same yeah the line uh, leave the charge yeah and so that's why if we have to uh, if we have same uh, charge yeah between the two charges yeah they will uh, they will expel each other yeah meanwhile for the different one uh, they will attract attract uh, attract each other yeah okay yeah so this is uh, for the drawing force line yeah okay now after this uh, after this video we are going to uh, uh, try yeah to solve this example yeah and we are going to do this on the next video so thank you for your attention until now and see you on the next video